Hi boys and girls, welcome back to math and lesson 7.2. I hope today's lesson is kind of quick for you. It's going to go over what 11 and 12 look like, not just as numbers or sets, but also with the word. We're gonna practice spelling the words too. So if you look in the top here on page 367, you will see there are 10 red cubes on the top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and one more would make eleven. So to make, we're going to practice writing the number eleven, which is a one and a one. Go ahead and practice. One, 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 and one, one. Now, yesterday we talked about the number 11 and we said there were three E's in there. So let's review, uh, review spelling. E-L-E-V-E-N, 11. Go ahead and trace that word. E, say the letters as you trace them, E-L-E-V-E-N, E-L-E-V-E-N, 11. Here the N at the end and the E at the beginning, 11. All right, we also practice the number 12. There are 10 blue cubes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. And then two more down here, 11, 12. 12, remember, is written with a one and a two. So let's go ahead and trace those. One, two, one, two, one, two. That makes the number 12. 12 is spelled T-W-E-L-V-E. -E. 12. 12. T-W-E-L-V-E. -E. Go ahead and trace those and say the letters as you do tracing. Excellent. You go ahead and turn to the next page, page 368. Again, a little more practice with counting. You can see they use some flowers here and they filled that 10 frame. So 10 ones all by themselves, 10 and one more would make 11. One set of 10 and one one out there by itself makes the number 11. Let's go ahead and trace again on this one, one. Hopefully. This is just a review for you and you can do a really nice job on that. Take your time, make sure they touch the top and the bottom. My smart board doesn't always cooperate, so mine goes down below a little bit. Number two, we have a set of 10 and we add one more. What does that make? If you said 11, you are correct. So let's go ahead and write the number 11 over there. We're going to take these and put it into an addition sentence. We're putting sets together, so we're adding. Um, how many are here? There are 10. And if we start with 10, we add how many more? One. It's going to equal how many all together? 10 and one more makes 11. Not so bad. What do you think? Next page. Now what number are we talking about? What's this number? 12, 12, T-W-E-L-V-E. 12 looks like this, a full 10 frame. So 10 ones or 10 flowers, one set of 10 and two ones, 10, 11, 12. Let's go ahead and trace those. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. That makes 12. And here we have how many in this frame? There are 10 plus one, two, plus two more, 10, 11, 12. So we write that here. It's a one and a two. Okay, so let's go ahead and take these that we put together and put them into an addition sentence. How many are here? There are 10, that 10 frame is full, plus how many ones by themselves out here? Two. So if we start with 10 and we add two more, how many do we have? We have 12. 
Fabulous. You guys are moving right along with this with me. I love it. Okay, up here on the top, we need to count how many flowers there are and then circle the number that is correct. Okay. Um, okay, so we have the numbers 11, 12, and 13 here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hmm. Well, that's not 11 or 12 or 13. Well, our friend Brooke, well, she picked some flowers. Brooke picked, hmm, how many did Brooke pick? We can decide. How about, let's do, um, let's do 11. So if we have 10, how many more flowers would we need? If you said one more, you are correct. You can draw the flower if you want. And then we will circle the number 11 there. Okay. Down at the bottom, we're going to draw 12 objects. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I'm going to do 11 and 12 in a different color. So you can see that, okay? Sometimes when we're starting out, it's easier if we can see that this is going to be one number, the blacks, and the reds are going to be another number. So 12 is equal to how many are here? 10 plus how many are here? 2. 12 is equal to 10 ones and 2 ones. 10 and 2 equal 12. Tomorrow, boys and girls, we're going to move on to the numbers 13 and 14. Just like we did yesterday, we're going to break them apart and draw them out and get a peek at how to write them and spell them. Have a great day with math.